Hey guys, welcome to another video, which is going to be, should be short, just me talking. Just wanted to show you how long it takes for oil pressure to build up after your car has been sitting for a long time. Now, a long time can be a month, also, you know, ye well, I was going to say years, but not really. Let's say you have a, a race car, you know, you use, you kind of put it away during winter time and you only use it for track days, auto crossing, uh, when it's when it gets warm, basically, right? So starting from, say, April all the way up to October, maybe even November, right? So the car will sit for, hold on, seven to eight months, which is quite a bit. So the main reason for this video is not to just start your engine after it has been sitting for a while, because you will get what's called a, a cold start. And during the cold start, the first half a second maybe, you know, not, not, not long, but it's enough to possibly do some damage to the bearings, rod bearings, main bearings, because there's not enough oil between the bearings and the journals, because it has been sitting for quite, quite some time, right? Now, I'll give you an example. I sometimes do oil pens, right? And one time, uh, it was a uh, V8, some V8 car, whatever. Uh, it was a classic car, and I did an oil pen. The oil pen was smashed in, so it needed a new pen, obviously. So, uh, but what happened was, after taking the pen off and examining it, it had cracks where the the rear main seal is uh, so what i was originally going to do was you know fix the pen somehow just to fix the dent where the bolt is on the bottom or cut it cut the bottom i actually ended up cutting off the bottom of the pen and welding on a, a new piece that i cut off from the from the new pen because those pens were not available and blah 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 you know they were too big so but the but the bottom end uh, fit right so but i had to do a lot of welding and stuff and also did uh welding on the cracks and all that stuff and i had to paint it prime it paint it you know and all that so that took probably about a week or so during that week the oil the car was up in the air on, on a lift and the oil kept on dripping for that week Obviously, it was drained before the oil pan was off and the oil kept on dripping for a week. It would keep on dripping for longer. That's how, how long it takes for that oil that's everywhere, you know, inside the heads, uh, around the, the, the black area, basically all over the engine, right? That's how long it takes for it to calm down. Now, if you start your car every day or maybe every other day, then that, that's not an issue. Start your car. Go, go driving. But if it sits, then that engine up top, especially, it's, it's almost dry. Now, obviously, there's going to be, you know, some oil left. It's not going to be super dry, like it was just built. Uh, but, you know, it has a lot less oil, is what I'm saying. So, to avoid that, co that first cold start after it has been sitting for, for months and months, Pull a fuse, pull a ignition fuse. In the case of Subarus, it's very easy actually. You want to pull the plug on the crank sensor, which is right in front, underneath the alternator. And then you just crank the engine until oil pressure builds up, and that's it. Then you then you can start it. Now, on a classic car, uh, well, you know, American American Muscle really, where there is uh, where those cars have carburetors. Chances are those cars will, will not start right away, you know, after a second or, or two of cranking. Actually, the, the chances are pretty big, actually. So really wouldn't worry about oil pressure on those kind of cars, right? Old carbureted cars. But on a fuel injected cars, they will start right up. Even, you know, it has been, let's say the battery is good, has been sitting for a year, you're going. So remember, don't start your vehicles without any oil pressure, really. I know it's, you know, it's not going to do much if you would, but it helps, okay? Save your bearings. Let, imagine if you were to do that, 
I don't know, 100 times the cold start or, or, or more, you would, I, I bet you, you would do some damage to the bearings because it's that split second once, once the car, when, when you just crank, you know, everything, the rotating assembly just, you know, rotates slowly, right? Just by the starter. But it, at that split second where it starts, the oil pump still needs to pump that oil. So it's actually for a, for a split second, or maybe maybe even a second, up to a second, I would say, there is no oil until that oil, that, you know, the oil, the oil pump needs to start pumping the oil, kind of kind of priming itself. Then it needs to pressurize the system by circulating the oil, right? throughout all the engine and, and, until, and until it starts dripping from the top uh, you know I, I bet it takes a few, you know some time you know second two maybe even three I don't know but it, it happens so fast the crank will spin a few times at least 20 times 10 20 30 times maybe I don't know and during those dry spins you may scratch the surfaces of the bearings so find out what you need to do to, to your to your car so it won't start. Disconnect. Let's see some of the things you can do. Pull the plug on a, on a crank sensor if it's accessible. Pull an ignition fuse. Pull a fuel pump relay or a fuse. If you do, if you kill fuel, it still may start actually. So maybe test that before you try it. Yeah, I'd, I'd say crank sensor and ignition sensor is probably the way to go if you know a better way type in the comments all right so now i'm going to just show you a short video of my 06 sti building up oil pressure after it has been sitting for about eight months not a single start during those eight months just sat in the garage all cold and lonely <laughs> you know you'll notice something it takes as long as priming a brand new build engine all right, check it out, and I'll see you next time. All right, cranking for the first time in eight months or so. Watch how long it takes for this thing to disappear. Oh, clutch. Building up, oil pressure building, good, took a while huh?